Hi, my name is Yannick Jacob. I'm an existential coach and a positive psychologist and uh, I used to run the Coaching Psychology Masters at the University of East London. I do a bunch of other things as well, psychology related, personal growth, professional growth related. Uh, today I want to give you a little bit of an insight in what I will be talking about on the 24th of February at the wonderful event of the Weekend University, a day on behavior change. Uh, I'm proud to present alongside my colleagues uh, Mick and Sheru, um, who will be giving you a perspective on behavior change uh, informed by, by psychotherapy, by how to change goal, how to set goals and, uh, and achieve them, what's the research angle on this, and also very important, um, how to set uh, habits, how to break old ones and how to set new ones. So what I want to do uh, in relation to that is give you a bit of a broader perspective, um, a positive existential perspective, as I call it. Uh, this is informed um, by my studies and my work around the science of positive psychology and existential philosophy, which I use in my coaching. And uh, what I want to add for this is how we can induce change top-down rather than bottom-up. And uh, what I mean by that is uh, Bottom-up behavior change means you, you actually ch work on the behavior as a starting point, the actual actions that you take. And uh, top-down means you change your perspective on things um, to then trickle down in resulting in behavior change. So what existential uh, coaching and existential philosophy can contribute to this is looking at the big questions about existence which is what the philosophy is about. It's big questions such as, who am I? Uh, how can I live a good life? What am I here for? Uh, how can I be authentic? How can I make authentic choices? Uh, what does it all mean? <laughs> you know, so these big questions, uh, I have learned that they influence all of the little behavior changes, all of the mundane behaviors that uh, people often exhibit in everyday life. So I started to hear these themes um, below the surface of what people have been telling me in the coaching room. Um, and often existentialism is seen as something quite dark and negative and people sitting in French cafes and contemplating how all the life is meaningless and that we're all going to die. Um, for me, my, my angle was always a positive psychological one, so uh, I've seen it as in essentially, inherently very liberating and uh, very useful. It's very, uh, there's a lot of freedom in existential philosophy when we when you come to think about it. So in the, in the context of behavior change, that's what I want to present. I want to show you how the big questions uh, of human existence trickle down into uh, small behavior changes that we can implement every day and how positive psychology can uh, offer interventions and, and some of the tools that we can combine with this. So very much a positive existential perspective on behavior change and hope to give you lots of practical tools with that, um, but like broaden your horizon as to what philosophy can actually add to the area of behavior change. So I'm really looking forward to seeing you on the day. And uh, if you didn't get tickets, um, I, I recommend you sign up on the waiting list because there's always a couple of people dropping out. And if you're not a member of the Weekend University yet, uh, I, I would suggest you sign up to that because that means you can get uh, access to the recordings a lot quicker. So I really hope to see a lot of you there on the day. Come say hello and uh, meet me at the social and the pub afterwards. I'm always happy to discuss these things. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.